praise the Lord, mighty prophet of the Lord. Amen. Now, um, as a Sophie, the Lord has spoken with me. The Lord again has spoken with me. Now, um, there is this baptism of all the bishops of the National Council of Bishops that will take place. I'm switching gears to a second visitation. Uh, there is a baptism that is prepared. It has been a long time in coming for all the bishops for their cleansing before the ordination service, before the sacred service of consecration that will take place at the Riverside Drive. So the baptism essentially takes place on Friday. That's an exclusive event only attended by the Council of Bishops and the ministration will be done by he that speaks with you, the servant of the Lord, the mighty prophet of the Lord himself. And so it's an exclusive event. It's only the National Council of Bishops that will be involved and the man of God here that speaks with you. However, now, this past night again, the second visitation that followed that visitation that I've just shared is when the Lord showed me that I am inside the baptism pool baptizing the bishops. And while I am there, a great visitation takes place inside that pool. Again, there is the baptism of the bishops of the National Council of Bishops that is scheduled to take place. It's prepared. It's a long time in coming, but it will take place this coming Friday. And while it's an exclusive event only for the National Council of Bishops, and as I see myself this past night baptizing the bishops of the National Council, a shocking and fearful and dreadful, tremendous visitation takes place while I am in the pool baptizing the 83 bishops that hold jurisdiction in this land. Well, uh, the Lord shows me this baptism. I see myself in the baptism pool. But as I baptize the bishops, then all of a sudden, I am instantly transfigured in the pool. There is a transfiguration that takes place in the pool this coming Friday. Again, the Lord has shown me that as I will be baptizing the bishops for their cleansing prior to consecration at the ordination service, that takes place on Saturday this coming weekend. I have seen myself, however, in the baptism pool at the baptism service. And as I was in the pool baptizing the bishops, then all of a sudden the Lord has now shown me this past night that event that as I baptize the bishops, all of a sudden instantly I am transfigured. A transfiguration takes place in the pool and he that speaks with you is totally transfigured in a flash, in a swift flash like lightning. And I can see the outline of my hand and all the garment and all that within that transfiguration. And I'm totally transfigured. But when I check now from this place where he showed it to me yesterday, when I check the transfiguration, I know my hair, how I look like. But when I looked there, I saw he that has all hair. I saw the Lord himself that was now in that position in tremendous glory. And then after that, I got transfigured back. Now, the Lord has also allowed me to share this with you. May those who have ears listen to the oracles of this hour. Shalom. Thank you.